I'd love to brag about the countless hours it took to restore the sewing machine, all the missing or broken parts that had to be remade, the arduous task of refinishing, and of course, the crushing difficulty of recreating the century-old artwork. But the truth is, this little gem of a machine came to us in such perfect condition that all she needed was a little polish to brighten her finish. She's a national machine dating to 1922. In America, they were sold, as you see here, as the paveway. Overseas, as the sunlight. Although National would happily badge these machines as anything a wholesale buyer requested. In production for almost three decades, these well-made machines come up for sale quite often and are an inexpensive option for anyone wanting an antique sewing machine. To thread a paveway, Bring a thread from the spool over between the two plates of the top tensioner. This is the adjustment knob. Then over to this thread guide and up and through the slot at the top of the needle bar. Bring the thread down from the take-up arm through this thread guide over to the tensioning spring back through the bottom of the thread guide down through a small thread guide and then through the needle from left to right. To wind a bobbin, pull this thumb screw out and rotate it to separate the main wheel from the rest of the machine. Bring the thread down, around this hook, up through the winding guide, and then around the bobbin several times until it has enough drag to catch. Move the bobbin winding assembly forward so that the wheel makes contact with the inside of the main wheel, and rotate it with the top coming towards you. That helps keep the drive wheel in contact with the main wheel. Once the bobbin's full of thread, slip it into the bullet shuttle, then bring the thread up through this slot opening, over, and pull that out the front. Then bring it to the side so that it comes out of that little opening. This small screw is the tension adjustment. Then place the shuttle in its carriage and you're ready to sew. I hope you enjoyed this video of our 1922 paveway sewing machine. Our next project is an 1882 Wheeler and Wilson 8, one of my favorite machines. I hope you'll check back to see how it comes out. And as always, thanks for watching.